Hey folks, Frank Smith III here. Welcome to the show. Frank Smith III, the comic book nerd, here with another episode. Okay, check this out. So I decided to move the table a little bit just to give a different angle. Sometimes it's good to just switch it up a bit. Okay, today I'm going to talk to you about uh, this book. I did a show earlier in the year about this particular uh, character. Well, I'm sorry, the book, the book itself. Now I'm going to read to you some of the stuff from the book because it's some amazingly interesting what the hell kind of moments okay that's what I love about it uh, the artist the, the person who created these characters his name is Fletcher Hanks look him up Fletcher Hanks this particular book is called the comics of Fletcher Hanks I shall destroy all the civilized planets and it was written by Paul Karasik Paul Karasik and this is the cover that guy right there, his name is Stardust, the Super Wizard. And on the back, you have this young lady. Her name is Phantoma, Mystery Woman of the Jungle. Okay? Super duper badasses. That's what these people are. Okay? Their powers are way past. Like, what? Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, let, me, let me give you an example. Here's an example. All right, I'm picking a random story here. The Super Wizard Stardust. Stardust, the scientific marvel whose vast knowledge of all planets, all planets, has made him the most remarkable person ever known, is devoting his abilities to crime busting. Okay, from his observatory on his private asteroid. Private asteroid. Okay. Uh, he looks at the various planets. His television. <laughs> His televisional crime detecting unit shows a horrible crime being planned on Earth. They're going to stop the Earth from revolving. I'm going to show you the picture in a minute. And they show an insert. Our anti-solar ray will check all motion and thereby destroy the power of Earth's gravity. Do you know what that means? Uh, do you know what that will mean? As soon as the motion stops, all the people from all the people will fly off the Earth's surface into outer space. What will happen to us? We'll chain ourselves to the ground. But first, we'll charge the Earth with our hydraulic balance ray to keep the sur to keep the water on the surface, and we'll magnetize all automobiles and ships so that they will stay on Earth. Right there. Look at them faces. They serious. And that started us on his um, obs observatory asteroid. <laughs> All right, next page. I'm going to just do them two pages. When everybody has disappeared into space, we'll reverse our anti-solar ray and restore the Earth's motion and its gravity. Then we can have the whole Earth and all of its wealth for ourselves. So Stardust is looking through his um, televisional crime detecting unit, whatever the he got a telescope thing, and he goes, "That's the dangerous Jip Clip Gang. Jip Clip Gang." Preparing to murder over half a billion people. I'll attend to them. And then he goes to Jip. Come on, you mugs. Get ready. We're going to release our anti-solar ray. The ray is released. And the earth be begins to turn more slowly. It finally loses all its motion. And it comes to a stop. And gravity is destroyed. People, as it comes, I'm, I'm going too fast. <laughs> As it comes to a stop and gravity is destroyed, people begin to rise from the surface and plunge helplessly into space. That's happening right there. Look at all them people. All right, so, okay, I'll tell you the next part, and that'll be it. Uh, meanwhile, the brilliant form of stardust darts across the heavens. The super, the super wizard is traveling on highly accelerated light waves in a tubular spatial. Oh, this is, I'm just going to stop here on this last page. Uh, so the, 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 the Jip gang, everybody should be off the earth by this time. He's there, there, him and his boys are chained to the ground, and he's about to throw a lever. 
And uh, he goes, everybody should be off the earth by now. We should have spared a few to make us make slaves of them. Perhaps a few are left. We can capture them. Stardust extra sight enables him to see the millions of Earth people drifting in space, uncos and uncos unconscious and gasping. Unconscious and gasping. So when you're gasping, it, <coughs> I believe you still have some consciousness. I, mean, I don't know. I've never been drifting in space. Okay. Uh, he sees the Jip Clip gang getting ready to reverse the anti-solar array and make Earth normal again. And one of the gang members is standing like this. We'll soon have it all for ourselves, Jip. As Stardust glides through space, he focuses his radiophonic thought recording ray, radiophonic thought recording ray, on Jip Clip. Why should I share all this wealth with these mugs? Oh, wait, wait a minute, hold on, what, what, I'm confused. Thought record. Oh, that was the thought. Okay, so Stardust made Jip's thoughts uh, audible. <laughs> and then the next scene, you see Jip Clip um, shooting his boys. Ain't that loyalty for you? Yeah. No, no honor among thieves. And then he's about to throw the ray. Now I have it all to myself. Jip reverses the anti-solar ray, and then the Earth begins to revolve again. Uh, you know that's enough for now. The point is, this character's name is Stardust, the super, the, the super wizard Stardust by Fletcher Hanks. I'm going to read that first part again. Stardust, the scientific marvel whose vast knowledge of all planets has made him the most remarkable person ever known. The most remarkable person ever known. And this dude has a private asteroid. That's a bad dude. Anyway, thanks guys for watching this episode. I really appreciate it. I'm Frank Smith III, the comic book nerd. This character is called the Super Wizard Stardust. He was created by a guy named Fletcher Hanks. I'm going to show you a picture of Fletcher Hanks right now. This is, a, this is Fletcher as an older gentleman, I suppose. There he is right there. That's Fletcher Hanks. So, uh, there's plenty more where this came from. There's plenty more stuff to read. I'll, re I'll get you guys another. I'll finish this story next time, okay? Thank you for watching. I'm Frank Smith III, the comic book nerd. You guys have a wonderful day. Please don't forget to subscribe to my website. I'm sorry, to my uh, YouTube channel, Frank Smith III Multimedia. All these episodes of the comic book nerd are under a, in, a, in a playlist, okay? Thank you so much. You guys have a great day.